In this video, I'm going to show you how we can resize an image using the pillow library. As you can see it on my screen, I have already imported the image module from the pill library and I have opened up an image called butterfly.jpg which is inside my resources folder. And I'm storing that image inside this IMG variable. So now if I want to resize this image, the way I can do this is there is a method inside the image module called image dot resize and what i can do is i can say img equals to img dot resize and this resize will take few parameters and the first one is going to be the new size to which we want to scale or resize our uh, original image it's going to be a tuple of values containing the width as the first value and height and this uh, height as the second value so what I want to do here with my butterfly.jpg image is I want to divide its width by 2 and divide its height by 2. So I can say int img.width. This img.width will give me the width of my original image. So if I divided it by 2, then I can say int img.height this will give me the height of my image then i will divide it by two also so now if i print my original width and height print width comma height sorry i'm typing with just one hand and copy it here paste it down here because i want to also print out the image width and image height after we have resized it so if i run this code we have few errors what is that okay sorry about that it's img dot width and img dot height also we need to write it here as well img dot width img dot height if i run it you can see this is the size of my original image. This is the size of my resized image. So this is the original width and this is the original height. This is the resized width and this is the resized height. Let's display both pictures. I can say img.show. I can also say img.show here. Dot show. Show run the code this is the resized image and this is the original image you can see there's a huge difference between both of them this one looks bigger and this one is definitely smaller so this has been downscaled as we are dividing its width and height by two so what if we want to upscale it so then we should multiply by two so if i multiply by two multiply by two here as well run the code this is the original image wait a second and this is the resized image this is the original image and uh, this is the resized image so it's working fine we can we are already able to resize our images but there is a few more arguments that we can pass to this resize method and the first one is resample this resample parameter takes many filters which are within our image module in the pillow library and if i come into the documentation you can see we have lots of filters we have image dot nearest image dot box image dot bilinear and lots of them so we can pick up any of these filters and use it inside our resample parameter so the difference between them is that if you want the maximum performance if you want your images to be uh, resized quickly then you should use the nearest uh, filter if you want the best downscaling quality and best upscaling quality then you should use this Langsos filter i don't know how to pronounce it so i'm just calling it a Langsos. so you can use this filter if you want the quality use this one if you want the performance use this one and you can see inside this table if you want to stay somewhere in the middle you can figure it out through this 
table so all you need to do is to focus on this table and choose whatever you want so i'm going to go for the quality so i'm going to say image dot lang source so this is the filter that i am going to use right now there's one more parameter to this resize function called box and the way we can use it is let's say i want to uh, take this part of my image and want to scale it up i only want to take the antennas of this butterfly and scale that thing up or scale that part of my image down how can i do this the way i can do this is i need to create a box around that part of my image so the way we are going to create that box is we are going to take this point and take its x and y coordinates then define the height of our box and then define the width of our box and then we will use those values inside this box parameter so i can come here and say box equals define a tuple and the first value is going to be the x parameter x coordinate of our point from which we are starting our box so let's say 20 comma 20 so the first one is the x coordinate second one is the y coordinate the third parameter is going to be the uh, width of our box let's say 100 and the fourth parameter is going to be the height of our box let's say 100 as well so if i run the code now you can see it has taken some part of our image starting from the 20 comma 20 point and and the height of our box is 100 and the width of our box is 100 then it has resized that image and scaled that part of our image so this is how we can use this box parameter in our resize method so if you want to resize only certain parts of your image you can use this box parameter and this is it this is how you can use the resize method of the image module of uh, pillow library so i think this is it for this video we, i will see you in the next one if you have any questions you can comment down below peace out